What's good, YouTube? This is Shango Man Game here, and welcome back to Midnight Suns. But that's that thought. We saw this cultist group. This cultist group. And you see Crossbones and the other people back, brought back this creature or person or goddess or demon lady called Lilith. And of course, the heroes, the people from Iron Man. Brother Strange, Scarlet Witch, Captain Marvel, etc. I'll try to stop Lilith and her evil plans. If we go to this person called the Caretaker, but her name is Sarah, apparently brought back us, which is a warrior, and apparently is a child of Lilith. And we were used to be a weapon against Lilith to stop her. So we got resurrected, brought back, and now we're here, like trying to stop whatever Lilith's doing. We got on our first mission as our created self, the warrior, the child of light and dark, to the sanctum. You know where Dark Strange will be at. And we got to the rooftop, and look who's waiting for us is Venom. At first, I thought it was okay. I thought it was going to be an easy fight. But then he was he pulled me down like the 16 damage and all that stuff. I'm like, oh my god. I legit thought I was going to lose that fight. I was like, who's going to be losing this first gameplay? <laughs> hey, that's how I'll beat him. And in the cutscene, my character was being stupid trying to charge that Venom by himself. It looked like he was down for the count. And then Spider-Man had to save him at the last second. And like I said in the video, what took you so long? And then we made our escape. And of course, because how our character reacted, Sarah was not too happy about that. And after that, that's where the video left off at. And that's where we're picking it up from. I hope y'all enjoying this gameplay of this game. So like I said, I'm giving it a shot. Hopefully y'all give it a shot too. I hope y'all enjoying it. Without further ado, let's go. That's not Tony. But make sure I don't have to talk to anybody. That was a complete fiasco. And it would have been far worse had Spider-Man not arrived when he did. Exactly. No kidding. Caretaker would have been pissed at Venom had actually eaten a hunter. Exactly. Yes, one disaster averted. But we still need to figure out how to get Wanda and the Sanctum back. Dang. Alright, see if Not bad, Hunter. Not bad at all. I appreciate it. You did okay out there, considering you were technically dead 72 hours ago. Okay. Here's a compliment. An impressive first outing, just as I had expected. You're going to do great things, Hunter. That means a lot. Come for you, Dutch Strange. Yeah. Hunter, you look scathed. Man, you look just like your daddy, Tony. And not in the good way. You look weird. Hey, for what it's worth, I think you did okay out there. You got some decent hang time. Even uh, given you were wearing, what, 70, 80 pounds of chain mail? <laughs> On the stark scale of reckless yet daring heroics, I give it a solid 6 out of 10. Don't worry, you'll get there. With a little help. Sure, Tony. Your support is appreciated. It's appreciated, man. Oh, no problem. I already got a few ideas cooking. You're not allergic to mimetic poly... You know what? What? Never mind. Why spoil the surprise? I, I couldn't help but overhear Auntie Caretaker over there telling you to get some rest. That uh, sounds like a good idea to me. I suppose I could keep you company on the way, seeing as our rooms Why? are in the same direction and all. Oh. Besides, no one should be forced to walk the hallways around here alone. Oh, you scared. Oh, you scared. I get you scared. So, here we are. The old room, huh? It's, uh, it's not bad. Functional. Solid construction. Almost cozy. Love the antique furnishings from the early Mephisto collection. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
Full transparency, Hunter, there's another reason I asked to join you here, other than my abject terror of this entire facility. Obviously. Stopped here before, while you were out, wanted to surprise you with a nice little housewarming present. Was all set to write you a lovely welcome note, but I'm fairly certain that wasn't red ink in your quill. Huh. Thanks for the gift, Tony. I think you'll like it. It's a limited edition. Okay. A limited edition what? Oh, you'll see. Huh. Well, I suppose I should leave before whatever monstrosity that is most definitely hiding under your bed jumps out, rips my face off, and then proceeds to feast on my soul. I'll leave you to it. May your so sleep scary, be Tony. with pleasant dreams, Tony. Right back at you. Oh, and if you hear the shrieking of a grown man, please ignore it. It's just me, walking to my room. You fight crime every day. You with superpowers. You scared of this house. Hi, I'm Tony Stark, but if you're hearing this message, you already know that. When I'm not saving the world, I solve the world's problems with technological means, like the one you're holding. I call you're it so the loud. Spark, a secure information and communication device built only for superheroes. It does all the usual private messages, pictures, and calls for some reason. But it also comes with access to Superlink, a private social network exclusively for your cape-wearing, world-saving compatriots. You might okay. ask, Tony, aren't you just repurposing a failed product from your communications division? If you do, I'll revoke access and let everyone else know you're a jerk. I call it the Wonder Man rule. Okay. Superlink is your connection to the rest of your team. Social networks were just for superheroes. Check the link frequently for updates from other heroes in the Abbey or Abbey or whatever. Let's see. Abbey Reyes. Yeah. Okay. All right. That's about it. Oh, we get it a deck. But we ain't got nothing right now. Yeah, that's all we got. All right. There was never enough room for my armor in this thing. Oh, finally. Outfits. Lost earned from missions can be spent to unlock new cosmetic options for the hunter and heroes, including outfits to wear around the Abbey or Abbe. It's like to purchase a new Abbe outfit for the hunter now. It's gonna take a while. Hold on a second. I'll wear that one. He's gonna have niggles on his neck. Okay. Anything else? Room upgrades. Lots is required to purchase Hunter's Fortress upgrades. Gloss can be obtained by completing missions. Why do they call it that? Playing a higher difficulty levels will increase the gloss rewards gained from combat. Well, I can get none. Mine at zero. Hello? Oh.
Yo, hey, what's up? E. Okay. What to say? No issues. Here. We were all so happy then. Damn me. Let's see. What else? Journal page. All right. My old journal. Maybe it is time I start writing in it again. Complete items, collections to gain special rewards. Okay. Now we're going to sleep. And no lag, we're good. Alright. Boom! Let her enjoy the moment. She's been visiting your door every morning for the past 300 years. Oh, it must have been so hard on her. Not just her. Okay. I suppose that's why I might have been a little curt before. A little? You already made the ultimate sacrifice once. Maybe I'm in no rush to see you do it again. We do not choose our destiny. But we can choose to duck. <laughs> First lesson you ever taught me. And still the most important. Especially now that you have all these eyes on you. I have noticed. To these people, you are a being of myth and legend. A grand hero of old. And they're right. You are a hero. But I also know the battle that rages within your soul. Oh yeah? It's not enough that you are a hero. You need to decide what type of hero you will be. I am sure there will be okay. plenty of opportunity for that in the days to come. For now, I would head to the forge. Our new guests are eager to show you something. Oh, really? This was a lot easier when it was just you and I beheading the Dark Legion as we traipsed through the woods. Don't forget about Agatha. I never could. Oh. Charlie was restless all night. I should have known something was wrong. We'll talk more later, but for now, Stark has requested your presence in the fort. I think he has another present for you. Okay. Good girl, Charlie. Whoa! Be a good dog, okay? And don't kill me in your sleep. Kill me in my sleep. Just stay cool. I want no problems. I'm not sure we've ever had so many eager new recruits come along in such a short time. We must be doing something right. Okay. Next thing I know, the sanctum is airborne and covered in slime. I don't get it. What's that? Strange couldn't just magic his way in? Something about the whole alien thing threw off his mojo. That explains so much. No wonder he gets so strange around me. See what I did there? I'm You're a not vampire. funny. I see everything. <sighs> this is going to be a fun apocalypse. 
Just doesn't look bad joke like that no more. So there's stuff all over the place. Back essence. Make sure to look around the place for now every now and then. Oh, check out Blade making nice with the big guns. I thought caretaker told him no more guns in the house. Captain Marvel is an exception. So he's supposed to be playing right. nice, right? Right. And now Stark is hard at work in the forge coming up with something for the hunter? The hunter needs it after that last beating. Hey. Man, can't wait till it's my turn for an upgrade. Prepare for a long way. You literally got a ghost thing, a ghost spirit in your... all of us, or you don't need no upgrades, man. into that flaming skull of yours yet? Hey, heard about what happened in New York, Hunter. I'm sure whatever Tony's cooking up down there will only help. We'll see. It better. Now? Think you can tell your friend inside there to turn it up a few hundred Kelvin? I could. However, it might shatter the containment spell preventing him from incinerating this facility. Ooh. I think we're good. And just in time. The forge Don't has spell, certainly man. Don't mess with it. changed. Right. Caretaker said this all happened after your siesta. What spooky castle would be complete without its own Babylonian demon-powered furnace? Sumerian fire demon. His name is Babs. Oh, now Babs. it all makes sense. Well, once you get past the esoteric terror of the situation, I found this thing actually has some uses. Molecular bonding, breaking down evil gamma serums, fashion accessorizing. Mm, yes, yeah, speaking Hey, we of... get it, Tony. We get oh, it. Oh, right. It's ready. Your armor seemed to offer minimal protection against the venom creature. I noticed. Yeah, I thought you could use an upgrade. Well Thank hammered. Thank goodness. Well fired. Caretaker did not mention that you two were such skilled smithies. Yep. I am Iron Smithy. Perhaps you should just try it on. Gladly. Now that is a suit. Still think I could have used a cloak. No. Mm. No capes. Like in the mode said, no capes. Stylish? Damn near indestructible. And we even got the size right. Not bad for our first collaboration. I still think it could have benefited from a cloak. No! You think everything could benefit from a cloak? I do not. Oh, I've heard the things you whisper to your cape when you think no one's listening. Oh, the joys of sharing a workspace. And I'll have you know this cloak has helped me save the universe from extinction on countless occasions. Could you at least tell it to stop rearranging things on my side of the cave? I have, but it considers you something of a slob. Oh. You know, I have a great psychiatrist in the city. Maybe you should talk to him. Although, I think he's working for Hydra right now. Dan's cancel it. Nah, Hydra, man. I hate to admit it, but somehow this ancient forge puts any arc reactor I've got to shame. Who would have thought mystically bound demon power would be so damn energy efficient? Or carbon neutral? Let me Certainly use it, bro. suit of yours done a lot faster than I expected. Speaking of, what's the verdict, boss? It is nice it, having an armorer on demand. I appreciate it. Anytime. I tried to make this version a little less palatable to that symbiote thing. It was this close to making it menthol flavored. The Say tools what? are just one part of the equation. You gotta know how to use them too. You were out, what, 300 years before we woke you from your eternal rest? I'm betting you have questions, so ask away, Hunter. Okay. I take it this new version is a technological marvel? Impact resistant carbon composites, some patent pending alloy mesh, and a few touches from Dr. Spooky over there. And hey, the built in communicator means we can talk to each other without sending a raven. Okay. Hmm. 
So it is a marvel then? Lightweight, nearly indestructible, and modular enough for future upgrades. Frankly, I wouldn't That's have used good. your old suit to wax the Mandarin's car. Is all this magic a threat to your new technology? It might surprise some people to hear this, but I do like some things with rules. Isotope oh, yeah? magnetic fields, and gamma oscillation make and a lot more sense to me than eye of newt, bat wings, and a sprinkle of sunshine. <sighs> At least they did before everything changed. Fair. I cannot help but feel partially responsible. Well, I wouldn't take it personally. We were detecting changes in both magic and science months before you... Woke up, but yeah, things have definitely hit high gear since then. Okay. Seen anything strange around here? What, other than my roommate? Boom! Roasted! <laughs> but on a more serious yeah, note, strange this strange. place is legitimately haunted. Mirrors look back at you. My room rearranges itself. And worst of all, magic cats. Really? The great Iron Man is not scared, is he? Let's just say I'll be more comfortable once I've studied the problem. I feel like I'm living on one of those paranormal investigation reality shows. You be willing to break the bounds of technology and robots, but just get at this stuff. That's crazy, Tony. What sort of things are you doing in here? Oh, that's right. You were out a while. Basically, we've got a gigantic demon inside the magic box here that provides near limitless power for whatever we might need. Sounds insane, but sometimes it's easier to just go with it. Okay. I am impressed with your resourcefulness. From where you're standing, I can see that. Still, I doubt I'll be branding one of these with the Stark Industries logo anytime soon. Because of the his... <laughs> what it's connected to. You must have an interesting origin story of your own. Well, just your typical American boy. Yep. Pops was a founding member of the military industrial complex. Mom, a famous socialite. Tragedy struck when I lost them both in a car crash, which turned out to be a hit from a rival corporation. I spent my early teens at MIT, trying to clear my head. I was all set to follow in Dad's footsteps as a war profiteer. Then one day, fortune shined on me, in the form of some errant shrapnel that lodged itself just above my heart. Yep. So I did what anybody in that situation would do. I built a super suit and started fighting crime. I guess we have all had difficult childhoods here. <laughs> yeah, no kidding. I can't tell you how hard it was to memorize all that at Skrull Sleeper Camp. Just kidding. Or am I? Are oh, the scrolls here? Thanks for catching me up. Are you really Tony Dan? Anytime. Oh, and speaking of things, remember that uh, creepy gamma goop you found from that hopped up Hydra soldier? Well, I gave it a peek and it explains a lot. If you have a minute, meet me at the anvil over there and I'll walk you through it. I promise it'll be worth your time. Okay. Now, I doubt advanced gamma thermodynamics was a hot topic at Yield Demon Hunting School, so I'm just going to give you the condensed version. I appreciate that. Closest I've ever seen to this substance is pumping through Bruce's veins. Part gamma accelerant, part unknown element. Calling it COIL for now, given its unique atomic structure. Man, I love acronyms. This stuff you is always more do. volatile than Nick Fury on a Monday morning. But Hydra doesn't seem to mind. They're using it to get stronger. Exactly. A few drops would make your average salamander look like Fin Fang Foom. Mm. Thankfully, with a little help from Dr. Spooky and our haunted oven over here, I think two can play at this game. You are not suggesting we start injecting ourselves with it? No, 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 no. Nothing like that. Though I can see some future applications for my energy drink line, I was thinking we apply this stuff towards upgrading our equipment. I like where good. this is going. 
Just give me a little time here and I can whip up some pretty fun toys. How about we give Hydra a taste of their own gamma-powered medicine for a change? Ooh, new coil. Get our gear. Let's get to work. What do you think? Knock back. Quick attack. With the chain too. All right. Hunter, when you have a minute, come meet me in the yard. You have gained the hobby of a current league equipped building. You take to the yard. Duplicate. Duplicate. Abilities can be combined into new, more powerful versions. Alright. Yeah. Let's start the blade. Hold on a second. Heroes must have eight abilities equipped to their combat decks. So equip the new ability. Was first unequipped ability you wish to replace. Sounds confused. Figure it out later. Welcome to the yard. At least that's what we're calling it these days. Caretaker put me in charge of your training. Too bad she didn't listen to me yesterday. Well, I see Ghost now Rider that we right know there. what we're up against, I think we can all use the practice. Any questions? I did, but they are about you. Right when it's time to train? From all Sarah told us about you, she never described you as lazy. I'm not lazy. I just want to get to know you, man. I learn faster if I understand the person who trains me. I can respect that. Go ahead. Can I ask about you? I guess. Is your name really Blade? Is your name really the Hunter? Yes. <laughs> oh, oh. I, really? Your mom, before she became the mother of demons, looked into your cradle and decided to name her firstborn child the Hunter. That is how I understand That's it. That's ridiculous. Like, you ain't gonna give me no it name? all kinds. So... Is your name really Blade? No. What is it? Well, you're lucky then. It's private. Is it embarrassing? No, the hunter. But I only share it with friends. You do not gotcha. consider me a friend? Not yet. Don't take it personally. Are you good? But you get know to your man. I got you. How did you become a Dampier? You say that like I had a choice. I was born this way. How is that possible? A vampire bit my mother. Problem was, I was still in the womb. I'm lucky I was even born. Don't know if that's how it always is, but that's the way it went down for me. Okay. How long have you been around? I don't exactly know. I think of myself as mid-twenties, maybe. I lost a lot of time. Much oh. of the last century was a blur. I have occasional memories. Almost like coming up for air before being yanked back down into the depths. What happened? I killed a lot of vampires. I hadn't lost my mind exactly, but I got into a rhythm and never stopped. Never had a reason to stop. Not until I met Caretaker. And then? Okay. She gave me a reason to stop. Now she cool then. What brought you to the Abbey? Caretaker. 
About ten years ago, she brought me back to the real world. Gave me a place to stay until I came back to myself. Did she ever say why? She said she thought I'd be able to kill more vampires if I was acting on more than just instinct. But I know it was more than that. She gave me safe haven here at the Abbey. Something I'd never known. Must have read half the books in the library by the time I headed out. So when oh, she yeah? reached out and asked me to be part of this weird little club, of course I showed up. Alright. Oh, the Midnight Suns. Tell me about the Midnight Suns. All right. Why did you join? Vampire hunting is a solitary affair. Guess I never found the right team. Is that all? No, but that's all I'll share for now. You really want to know? Put in the work. Okay. If I trust you, I'll have more to say. You can trust me, man. What can you tell me about the others? Nothing. Ask them yourself. Okay. I'm not asking you to break anyone's confidence. Fine. Which one? Oh. Uh, Robbie. What about Robbie? He's exactly what he seems. Well, sort of. He's open with people. Easy going. Sometimes that comes across as dopey, but don't get the wrong impression. He's quick to make friends, and once he does, he's your friend for life. So don't let him down, or I'll hold it against you. Who else? Nico. Tell me about Nico. She's the youngest, but she acts like she's in charge. Clearly. I let her act like that. She's usually right, and she keeps us on track. I didn't think we'd get along, but we wouldn't be the Midnight Suns without her. She didn't what let leaders say that. She has a lot of heart, and that's why we let her. Anybody else? Magic. What do you know about magic? Keeps to herself. That is it? She's a private person. Until she lets you in, that's all you need to know. When does she That's like me a little in? bit. At her own pace. Respect that, and it'll happen faster than you think. Anybody else? Here, take Tell her. me what you think of Sarah. Well, there are few people I tolerate, even less who I like. Sarah, I respect. She sees the big picture, and we're a part of it. I'd follow her to hell if I had to. And from what I understand, we may have to. I am huh. surprised she commands such respect. I'm surprised that you're surprised. You know what she's like more than any of us. I do. Anyone else? That's all, man. That's getting annoying, bro. Nobody else. Sure. Do you have any thoughts on the team as a whole? I think we're the only ones aware of the danger Lilith poses to this world. And I think we're pretty green. But enough training will get us through it. Speaking of training, we doing this, or are we gonna keep wasting daylight? We'll train, we'll train, relax. I am ready to train. Finally. Open the building. Time's wasting, Hunter. If he possesses two copies of an ability. Caretaker said I need to be a team player. So I guess I'm letting you choose for me too. They can be combined to create a new, more powerful version. Yeah. Later. All right. All right, then. Sub. Thanks, Blade. Mm-hmm. I go to Carol. Hey, hey, mm -hmm. Hunter. Hey, Danvers. Like the way you move out there, Hunter. 
Guess Doctor Strange picked the right supernatural demon hunter to resurrect. I'm Carol. Carol Danvers. But you can call me Captain Marvel. I'll call you Danvers. <laughs> Carol's fine. Just thought I'd throw a bone to the Avengers PR team. Not gonna lie. Going a few rounds in Vampire Guy's Magic Thunderdome sounds like fun, but we've got bigger fish to fry. Well, not so much fish as that ginormous invulnerable sewer monster that swallowed the sanctum. Yep. The Venom creature surprised me before. He will not do so again. That thing's tougher than a flurkin' furball. You better steer clear of him and his creepy slime shield for a while. Strange Caretaker and the rest of the right. funky bunch can try and magic their way through that shield all they want. <sighs> if my time as a pilot taught me one thing, it's that sometimes you've got to find a workaround. As in Hydra, they've got to know the way inside. Steve's always said they aren't much for talking, but then again, I'm told I can be rather persuasive when I need to be. Well, if there is any time to put your powers of persuasion to work, now is the time, Captain. Trust me, Hunter, I'm looking huh. forward to it. Hydra's been a thorn in me and Steve's asses for years. Can't wait to remove them for good. Find me in the war room when okay. you're finished here. There's a few things we should discuss. Oh, and Hunter? Welcome back from the dead. Good to be back. Time to get going. Nothing is certain these days, but these readings are too distinct to ignore. The gamma signature is... Sorry, Bruce, we lost you. Did you say gamma? Yes, get. Uh, hang on a second. Come on, Tony. You managed to stream the Super Bowl to a Kree battleship 50 light years out. This should be easy. How? Oh, How's that possible? We year for that game, and you know the Skrulls would have spoiled it for us if they got the chance. Well, can't you just... I don't know. Work my magic again? See, that's the problem. This time I am working with actual magic, and let me tell you, it sucks. It's harder than working around tick, huh, Tony? The gamma signature is completely inverted. The daughter nuclei are being reabsorbed into the parent nuclei, which is impossible. If the gamma signature from the sanctum is really that unique, Bruce, then couldn't we just... Hey. Sorry, I'm still working out a few gremlins in the system. Try sunlight, and whatever you do, avoid water. Oh, wait, you're being serious? <sighs> Oh, we should key. be able to track this new gamma signature to its source then, right? I'd do it myself, but we seem to be having a little IT trouble today. <laughs> Please. <laughs> Old Central here is ready to grind through that data like chum. What exactly is a Central? C-E-N-T-R-A-L. Cognitive encryption, net transmogrification. Uh, we'll figure it out later. Sending coordinates now. Didn't even finish the rest. Hope your gremlins enjoy gamma spectroscopy. Yeah, stop that, man. Ah, well, he's been a little moody lately, ever since, you know, the problem with the big old green I guy. I heard that. Banner can't turn into the Hulk? Huh? Not sure if we should be frightened or relieved. That makes two of us. Oh, hey. Come on. Happens to everyone. Well, okay, not everyone. Nice work, Bruce. I know that place. Creepy abandoned warehouse in the bad guy part of town. My favorite kind. Anybody up for paying it a visit? Definitely. Oh. Aw, see that? Teamwork goosebumps. Find me when you're ready. Me and Blake gonna work out just fine. He legit look like the only person that looked decent on here. Multi-million dollar piece of experimental technology. And she kicks it. The two of us on the mean streets of New York? Evildoers beware. A hey, mirror table. You're just... Excited for another mission? I'm excited. And I'm probably not even going. Okay. Alright, here we go with this mission. 
I'm not gonna try to pronounce that. It was just recently that the Hudson Yards Development Restoration Association purchased this entire block. I'll let you think about that one for a minute. The years have identified an abandoned warehouse where Hydra may be operating. Blade and the Hunter join Captain Marvel to investigate. Let's get it! Fix your face! Let's see. Yeah, let's French go. coat, sunglasses at night, brooding personality. Something tells me these midnight warehouse raids are pretty normal for you. And the frame rate on this Very. game is not that good so far. I'm not, I don't know how I feel this about area it. area in particular? Occasionally. Good for a late night snack. Oh. The what? falafel place down the road stays open till three. Oh, I'd say. Oh, right, sure. So what you talking about? Next time, save us. Hey, magic. One of these days, I'll join you on a mission, and you will see what I am really capable of. I can't wait. Let's go. Gamma signatures and unstable isotopes aren't really in my wheelhouse, so we'll be patching Dr. Banner through from Avengers Tower once you reach the other side. Almost feels like cheating with you two on our side. What's going on down here? Probably can scratch a bandend off the description of this place. You seeing this, Bruce? Getting all sorts of weird down there. Johan Fanoff. That's the guy from earlier. Heck. I heard he was dead. Well, hoped is perhaps a more accurate description. Calls himself Faustus now. Smartest fanatic in the room. It's a small room. Hydra's resident mad scientist. Not just Hydra's. Lilith's. That's magic coming from those crates. I can feel it. Yeah? How about gamma radiation? You feeling that too? Because that's some pretty evil looking Hydra tech down there. Gamma and magic. Gamma and magic. I'm gonna need you to use your science brain on this one, Bruce. We need to approach this situation oh, carefully. Combining those energies is an explosive proposition at best. Think scalpel, not hammer. Stealth, not strength. Yeah, they I don't burst. do stealth. Kill them. Here we go. You really couldn't choose stealth, Danvers? Ridiculous. I always considered Faustus a bit of a crackpot, but his fundamental science must be sound. The device would have surely exploded otherwise after your display, Carol. Learned it by watching you, Bruce. Let's see. Slash this one. Let me think. Smart. Boom. Strike. Not range. Shoot. You shoot. And you. Mine. Get a blade. Cut it shell still. What 
Hey! I saw a move like that once, centuries ago. Hydra. Twelve damage. Payback's okay, I got you. That's six. Good. Was that really your twelve? Oh my! Arm beta moving into position. This is all your fault, Danvers. This is all your fault. This mode allows you to quickly assess the entire battlefield and the condition of the enemy units. I've never been one to buy into the science of magic, but the data I'm seeing is hard to ignore. There are more things in heaven and earth, Horatio. You know you're talking to a vampire, an alien type. Yeah. Cannot possibly match your strength. Two for one. Boom. There we go. I level up. Myself every day. somehow stabilize the rate of decay within the particles themselves. How else could he be achieving such a high yield? I don't know, Bruce. I'll be sure to ask him when we're done punching out the bad guys. Yeah, let's see. That's the case. Behold the light's gift. Do you? Arigato. What is it? Two out. Time to get You're down. Looking Level good. Up. Feeling good. Loot. Oh, blast. Save this one just for you. Boom. That is one way of making your presence known. Barely a scratch. Jeez. Fear is temporary. I am Not forever. Bad. Perhaps Faustus's device is worth further study. If you wouldn't mind, Carol, I'd prefer it if you and your supernatural associates not... Smash it? Yes. But... How? You were too weak for this fight. Go! Now! Quickly! Let's go! 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 Escaping! Ah, the perfect opportunity to field test Mother's device.
do. Good. Get her. She got powered up. Big mistake. Retrieve the mysterious artifact from the truck. Break the Hydra shield guards protection to access the truck. Use the artifact hard to secure the artifact. For the record, Bruce, I did not smash that thing. Noted, Carol. Perhaps you might direct all that energy towards your newfound adversaries instead. And the mysterious cargo they're attempting to escape with? Yep. Hold on a second, y'all. Had to turn off the heater. A pathetic attempt at intimidation. Let's see. This angle will be the best approach. Obviously, we got the marble. Just probably hit this guy. I think you got it. Get the Marvel now. Go binary. Playing three other Marvel cards will draw the go binary ability. In her binary state, that Marvel will deal significant more damage. Yo. The freaking lag today. I can use right now. That's not supposed to hurt. Oh no. They're hoping to wear me down. Enforcements. Preliminary analysis of the blast confirms high levels of gamma and various unknown energies. Unknown to you. There is dark magic at work here. You must not let Hydra escape with it. I'm on it. It's one out. Nice move. Thing to worry about. Approximately 16,342 more to go. I suggest starting with the remaining Hydra forces in the vicinity. Never seen that before. We will not fail! Come on, come on, come on. Survive. Damn, if I don't hate fanatics. Damage. Come on. All right, that's enough. Chill out. Relax. You suffer for that. To be 
crystal clear. We won't be able to recreate Faustus's experiment or track potential future variants gamma signatures without a baseline resonant sample from his initial occult catalyst. Got it. Stop the truck. It's about time. Knocked out. That's one hell of a move. Well, that's exciting. I'm on it. No. Up, Carol. That's getting old. Me getting shot getting old. Oh, I'm out. Ah, these delays can be quite frustrating. Infuriating even. I suppose Never by now I'd normally be tromping through the warehouse hurling the puny truck at the moon. Don't worry, Bruce. I've got a pair of torn purple pants with your name on them. Uh huh. That was something. for people like us to beat up chumps like you. Oh, yeah. You've had this coming. Turn out. Remind me not to get on your back. Oh, no. Bro, our ally requires aid. The more, the merrier. Oh, we're not stay alive. Advantage is mine. There we go. Weak, even for Hydra. On blade. I'm up. Lucky to still be breathing. The enemy has the upper hand. We're all gonna get a shot. Running on fumes here. There we go. 
Last one. Time's up for these jumps. We did it. What is this thing? Bad guy crate, full of bad guy stuff. I know those symbols from the time of the first hunt. That cliff means barrier. That one, almighty, something, something. Gods and demons. So a spooky bad guy crate. Very spooky. Designed to contain powerful magic. Be careful. <sighs> Got it. Don't cross the streams. Never do. Set. How about we get this thing back to the Abbey and see for ourselves? Let's go. Another mission. Success. Nice job out there, kid. I mean, I didn't get Hydra bombed until my 10th run with the Avengers. Kid, you do know that I'm a good three centuries older than you, right? I got my old man compared to you. And you've got a lot of catching up to do. Okay, Abbey tournament tonight. Sure about that? Last one got a little heated. The eternal spirits of vengeance take technical fouls very seriously, especially in the fourth quarter. Forget it. Tonight is movie night. It is always movie night. Exactly. Wow, well, moves off awesome, jail man. again. Who made this game? Wilson Fisk. Well, if parking is free, <laughs> clearly no one from Manhattan. You know what they say? All work and no play is how we ended up with Ultron. Come on. You should hang out. All right. I should rest another time. Social anxiety. <laughs> hmm. Well, let me see. How did this work again? Oh, Nico sent you a message. Are you there? By the way, this is Nico. In case nobody gave you the rundown on how the spark worked. Blade and Captain Marvel. Just fill us in. Freaky stuff. Especially Bachelors. I'm not, not going to say that. And they all just left me here alone. Come hang out. Thank you, Nico, but I am tired. Whoa. Good. You answered. Getting hard to keep finding ways to say open door around here. And despite what Robbie says, Welcome I room. don't think the staff of one speaks high elven. Blood magic stuff. Hey. Chill with that. Cool room. Spacious. Oh, is that bed for Charlie? Yes. So, if you're planning on giving me some sort of brooding code of the stoic warrior speech, I'm immune. Just ask later, Magic. From what I just saw out there, whatever crazy ancient living weapon stuff Caretaker put you through back in the day did a real number on you. We got a lot of work to do. Work? Yeah, talking to people, making friends, basic human stuff, or quasi-human. <laughs> You're a midnight sun now, one of us. Nico, I was just Hydra bombed. I could use some rest. 
You and me both. Been bad dreams every night for me lately. I uh, keep seeing Wanda. She... Never mind. I will meet you outside. Yes! I'll go nuke us some popcorn and you pick out a movie. Oh, and it may just be the two of us. The others went oh. outside, needed to cool off. Really need to hang a fan over that forge. Or maybe crack open the casket of Asia Winters a little? Okay. I'm gonna hang on with Nico. But we'll do that in the next video. Ugh. A lot happened a little bit, or not that much happened that much. We got talking to the group. Talk to Blade a little bit. Talk to Tony. He's gonna give us a new suit. And I'm liking it. It's look good. Compared to the other one. This is an upgrade. And we got this machine. That's a way of having gamma radiation and magic go together. We don't know how it works. Maybe we'll find out in the next video. It's been Shango, and I hope you all liked the video. If you did, hit the like button. If you want to comment about how the video was or any recommendations, just comment underneath the video. If you want to see more, subscribe. It's been Shango. I'm out. Peace.